you know, it's been a uh, tough training camp, you know, getting ready for uh, a big fight like this. You know, you've got to put everything uh, of yourself into it. And, uh, you know, you've got to really... you got to really want it more than your opponent. You think you could step in to Assassin's Creed Revelations multiplayer? You think you can step in to Antioch map when I'm the Sentinel and drop a smoke bomb on me? Is that what you think you're going to do? And I feel like uh, that's something... I've got the advantage of, you know, other than the fact I'm just generally more skilled, better looking and, uh, you know, have a bigger dick. You know, I just think all those things kind of just come into the fact that uh, he's really got no hope here. You know, he's uh, he's in over his head, I think. You know, I'm just really putting the work. I've got the, I've got the, the work ethic that's going to put, put me over the line in terms of really, you know, picking up the win here. I just don't think... He has what it takes, and I think it's going to be very obvious to people, you know, the p- training I've put in uh, compared to him, and uh, the preparation I've put in uh, analysing my opponent, um, you know, typing hateful comments on his YouTube channel, um, trying to, you know, you know, cyberbully him and stuff, like that sort of stuff that, you know, that really gets in his head, you know, that gives me the advantage. I'm just an overall better person, if you know what I mean. You think James is going to touch this? You think James is going to touch this? Please tell me how. Hopefully everyone's ready for this, because I'm going to take him up on his offer, just to prove to him and anyone else who thinks they can challenge me. No, I really don't have anything to say about his response, you know. He's uh, trying to play the good guy up and trying to, you know, think uh, his popularity is going gonna, to gonna win him this battle. But, you know, it's not a popularity contest, it's a contest of skill. And good looks, and uh, I have both. Um, and I'm gonna gonna ruin his day. You know, he's he. he there's gonna be streams done uh, with his subscriber count going down. That's how devastating it's gonna be for him and his channel. You know, your subscribers will all be like, "I can't say subscribe to this guy. What a <laughs> loser! He got destroyed. Tyler destroyed him." What will happen to the Kill Connor Club after? I don't know. You know, I think. Uh, I think I'll still be happy to do it as I am a super humble kind of person and, you know, just really always willing to put, you know, put differences aside and always, you know, very respectful of my opponent. Uh, I'll be happy to do it, but I think he'll he'll be crying too much um, and he'll be too upset to be able to ever do Kill Connor Club again, you know what I mean? Like, he probably won't do YouTube videos anymore after this. Uh, I doubt it. You know, there's very little chance. Um... That, that that's gonna happen so you know whatever it's up to him i'm i'm happy i'm happy to keep working with him but i just don't see just don't see him wanting to work with me after the devastating uh defeat you know oh hey man heard you liked horses this is what happens when dynamite meets richard the horse Not great. No, I don't think I've gone too far. You know, I've just said the truth. Um, I'm, I'm just said the truth. I'm a better player than him. Uh, you know, I'm gonna I'm gonna put him away early. We're not gonna go into any fourth game. It'll be the first three done and dusted. He's gone, finished, over. You know, I've just been putting in way more work. Been putting in way more work than he has uh, to really uh, deserve the win. That's just the truth of the matter. Simple as that. There's nothing else to it, really. <laughs> Fucking. Mm. Fucking cheated. I'm sending him a hateful message over Xbox Live. Fuck that guy.